I'm just wondering if you can give us any idea from your experience in Germany how long you think it's going to be before we build up a body of contractors who understand and are familiar with the techniques that we are mm. going to be using. I'm convinced that it will be much faster when we were able to do that uh, because now uh, all the basic information is available mm -hmm. and what I've seen from AECP so uh, that is that you have a lot of persons who really did understand that completely mm -hmm. so that's a, a whole different condition like we have had at the beginning mm -hmm. because we had to uh, at the first time, we, we have to convince ourselves because mm. I was starting with just one building and I didn't know whether the office building will work, whether the, the bath will work and so on. So we had to, to go on to that and now you all you know all about that. Uh, so I, I really do, do miss the experience how fast that could g grow. What I've seen is, say, example in the uh, United States of America, uh, they started uh, some years ago and, and this is now a really growing uh, thing much faster than it mm. was in, in, in Germany. I think it's it's two or three years. It's depending on how you are able to create this educational system. Education is very important. And what is very important, that was a little bit strange in UK, to be honest. Strange was that it took a lot of time for you to build the very first buildings. Mm. Now, now we have some, uh, but how long do we have that discussion? It's five years or mm. seven years or whatever. So that took very long compared mm. to other uh, countries. But mm. now you have, and now you have lots of quite good examples. Mm. So this is, uh, I don't know, it might, might, might be that the British are somehow take longer time to discuss it mm. before they really start <laughs> to do something. Is that, <laughs> is that true? And, yeah. and then, but if they do, they do it... Uh, and we go for it. And we go for it. Yeah, is that, is <laughs> that, is, is it, is that a, a right? right. Uh, yeah. Maybe, maybe. So it might be even yeah. even more uh, uh, fast uh, mm. uh, when we discuss now. It's, it, it's, mm. it's always difficult to see that. It's, uh, it depends on how uh, flexible the practical guys on the building sites are. Mm. What are the important things that we should be doing to promote? No. The very first thing, of course, is we build examples. Right. Uh, because the build examples will not only be these buildings existing, but all these people living in mm. there, uh, which are the promoters of the mm. idea. This is what turned out in Germany. It, it, this is growing all the time. Yeah. When you start a first, uh, a, a good first example, of course there has to be, this is again important, uh, if there is somebody now going to create a passive house in Britain, AECB should try uh, to make sure that it's a good uh, development going on there, uh, and and uh, because it's not so many now at the moment, you can do that. Mm. It is important that the very first examples are, are well working, and after that, um, well, now when we have the examples, uh, the education is the, the most important thing. And uh, well, I have seen that you already started courses on PHPP, mm. cursing, uh, courses on, on construction, that you all have a, have created this. Uh, for our AECB gold standard, uh, this booklet, mm. this is very important again, because not everybody has to create a new solution because mm. it's already there in the, in the booklet. So uh, this is the right thing to do.